YouTube, how are you doing? It's Friday. It's a reason to be happy to celebrate because you made it through another week at work and now you get to relax, get to chill out. What a better way to do that than watch some DGen reps. Spend some, spend a good 10 minutes or so with your YouTube friend, DGen reps. Because I think you guys are my friends. I read all the comments. Love the feedback. You guys helped me. Hopefully I uh, could help give you a nice little break from all of the suffering of the world. But now we've got a brand new first edition, debut edition, Don Russ UFC. I opened the hobby box and it was pretty good. I got, I got some good stuff in there. So let's see how the retail is. We got Chev, Crunch Time, Johnny Bones, Production Line, Press Proof, Izzy. I like this card. Press Proof. Take that. It's a really cool it's a really cool insert. Four knockdowns. I don't know. Is that four knockdowns in one fight? I don't know what uh Big Doug Israel last uh, knockdown. Oh yeah, where he knocked out Kelvin Gaslam four times. One of the best fights ever. The Iceman. Car France. Macy Barber. Macy Barber, if you're watching this. I'm about your age, Macy Barber, and I'd like to take you out. So if you're watching this, Macy Barber, hit me up on Instagram. It's in the description. We got Dom, Cater, Perez. We got our first rookie card, Rogerio or Hajirio Bontarin. First rookie card, we got duos, Amanda Nunez and Shevchenko. I was hoping we got we'd get to see them fight again because the second their rematch was very close. I thought Shevchenko won that fight, but then Amanda goes on and loses to Pena. So now it seems like we won't get to see the trilogy. But uh Rosa Strike Santos. Yeah, Ira Rodriguez just got booked against um, Brian Ortega. That's a great fight. Dominic Reyes Retro Series, Dan Hendo. Ooh, and look at that. Tanner Bozer. Cool little, uh, not numbered or anything. I don't know. Was this part of the uh, look for Blaster exclusive rated rookies? I don't know what uh, this is here, but it's cool. Tanner Bozer is an all right fighter. Would have liked... Someone better, but it is cool. Pink. All right, let's keep it moving. Tuivasa, who's on some roll right now. Ty Tuivasa. Let's keep it moving here. So not, it's, it's a fun rip. I don't know if I got anything, like, worth much yet, but, uh, I don't know, it's fun. There's a good assortment of cards, and, I mean, you, you, when, with the Chronicles... Oh, and there we go. Marvel's Khabib. That's not a bad card. So yeah, like with the Chronicles, it was just like there was only 10 fighters that you could get. And it was like every card was pretty much Gilbert Burns. But um, but yeah, there's, there's plenty of an assortment of fighters here. This is, this is definitely a step up. Definitely a step up from the Chronicles. All right, we got Uriah Hall. Derek Brunson, Y. Lee, RDA, Johnny Bones, Giga Chikadze, Magicians, Izzy, Pyotr Jan, Craftsman, and then it's a lot of just base cars at the end here. So our last pack, the first box. Come on, let's get something huge. Something huge here. Shogun, Chandler. Lionheart Smith. All right, here we go. Finally, another rookie. We got Fizev, really good fighter. Another production line, Holly Holm. Just uh, had an interesting decision. And look at that. We got Charles Dubronx Oliveira. A nice orange parallel here. Really cool. And you could hear my cat in the background. 
meowing at the door because I closed it. If you have cats, you know the problem. You can't you can't close your doors in your house when you have a cat, or else you uh, get the problem I'm having right now. So, gonna have to. You know what? I'm just gonna open the door real quick. Sorry about that. The show must go on. The show must go on. Here we go. New stack right here. Fresh stack. We do this in one take, guys. Get these uh, base cards out of the way. We got another Marvels Shevchenko. And look at that. Nate Diaz. Pink press proof Marvels. Really nice. Really nice first pack. I really dig this. Pink Marvels. Nathaniel Diaz. Let's, uh, you know what, Khabib, you're retired. Let's uh, show some respect to the 209 and, you know, the base cards. The Spider. And Anderson just looks better and better boxing every time he shows up. Forget who he just boxed, but I watched some of it. He looked really good. Billy Quarantillo. Promising future for him. Crunch time, Khabib, Magicians, Connor, and some base cards. We don't got time for the base cards. We get straight to the point here. Pantoja, Makachev, Robbie. Does Makachev even have a fight booked? What's the deal with Makachev? Are they giving him a title shot or what? Stipe, we got a... Mackenzie Dern, and Mackenzie Dern is, is beautiful, but they do no justice to her in these pictures on this card. She looks like a xenomorph from the movie Alien in here. I don't know what's going on with her neck, but they did her really dirty because she is a beautiful woman. And yeah, I simp, I simp for the uh, women's MMA fighters. I am, uh, I do, I simp, I simp for them. Shameless simping. Glover, Kelvin, Luke, Rob Font, Voices of the Octagon, John Anik, Production Line, Nganu, Max Holloway, who is going to fight for the belt again. Really looking forward to that. Some guys just, they match up well and they put on good fights. Can't complain they're going to fight a third time. There's no one else. And it's entertaining. It's not like we're watching Lewis and Ganu or something. You know, these guys, these guys bring it. Costa, Leon Edwards, Jiri Prohaska. He's going to get a shot at the belt soon. Going to get a crack at it. Rose Nama Yunus, Crunch Time. Why Lee and Joanna, they're going to fight again. The Iceman, Shabazian. All right, all right, base cards. So many base cards just like gathering up. I need to, I really need to get better at making piles. But last pack here, and then we go on eBay and look some of these cards up. Hermanson, Stipe, Cyril Gone, Izzy. We got something shiny in there. Tracy Cortez, rated rookie. Max Holloway, and we got Aspen Lad. Ugh, not the best way to close this out, but hey, we got we got some decent hits. I think that Nate Diaz press proof and this Charles Oliveira card will uh, definitely be worth something. So, thank you all so much for watching. I hope you enjoyed this. Found these boxes at Barnes and Noble. Got pretty lucky, so. Check your Barnes & Noble if you want to get some of these DGen rips. Let's go on eBay, see what these cards are worth.